بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم اینڈ السلام علیکم دس از کیمبرج پرائمری میتھمیٹکس لرنرس ورک اینڈ آئی ایم آر سی ایس این ان مائی ٹوڈیز ویڈیو وی آر گوئنگ ٹو اسٹارٹ یونٹ نمبر ٹو دیٹ از جیومیٹری اٹ از اباؤٹ ٹو ڈی اینڈ تھری ڈی شیپس اوکے سو لیٹ اسٹارٹ اٹ از آن پیج نمبر تھرٹی نائن so for a uh, introducing this unit geometry first of all we will introduce 2d and 3d shapes to our students the major difference we can tell them is 2d shapes are flat just as we draw a square on a paper 2d shapes are flat or they are just a piece of paper or just on a chart paper you can say that a square a triangle rectangle it can be any shape but it is just flat you these shapes cannot hold anything right a flat shape cannot hold anything in it so it is a 2d shape okay 3d shapes are thick they are they can hold something and uh, one of my child once said that uh, 3d shapes are moti shapes M moti in urdu they are moti shapes they are thick they have volume they can hold something so this is the major difference okay so uh, we will tell the students the names of these shapes the first one is cube the second one is sphere and the third one is cylinder tell them to learn the spellings as well the first one cube c u b e cube and then sphere s p h e r e sphere how to learn the spellings s p h e r e s p h e r e sphere okay cylinder c c len l i n len d r d r cylinder if you break down the spellings then it will become easier for your students to learn the spellings okay and what are these these are squares there are how many green shapes One, two, three, four, five, six green shapes, and there are one, two, three, four, four blue shapes, and there are mm, one, two, three, four, five, five red shapes. And uh, don't worry if it is not written on the book. You can ask your students to write down the names of these shapes here. I usually do this. even if it is not written on the book i ask my students to write the names of each shape for them to memorize and uh, revise the names of the shapes okay the green shapes are squares s q u a r e square circle c i r c l e circle um triangle t r i tri angle a n g l e angle okay how do i say the spellings like this like c a r c l e circle i say spellings like this for because when i say like this students learn them more quickly and easily like the tip i told you for cylinders C Y C L I N L I N L I N D R D R C L I N D R. You can break down the spellings for the little champions so that they can learn them easily. Okay, by showing this picture, you can tell the students that three um, D shapes are our houses, buildings, towers, everything like uh, the fridge in our house. or cabinets drawers these all the things are 3d shapes even the sofa where we sit is a 3d shape because it can hold something it has a volume you can put something inside it and it takes huge space on the ground 
and 2D shapes also take space like the tiles on the floor are 2D. Tiles on the floor or carpet on the floor is 2D. It takes space on the floor. But when you are talking about volume, it will take space not only on floor, upright in the space as well in your room. Okay, so these are the examples of 3D shapes. We live in a 3D house. Okay, we live inside 3D shapes. It's written here. We have 3D shapes all around us. Introduce these keywords. 3D, cube, cylinder, edge. E-D-G-E, edge. E-D-G-E, edge. Face, 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 sphere. S-P-H-E-R-E, -E, sphere. Okay, so, okay. You can hold a 3D shape in your hand. 3D shapes have, we can hold a 2D shape as well in our hand, but a 3D shape can hold something inside it. But a 2D shape cannot hold anything inside it. Okay. And 3D shapes have edges and faces. While as 2D shape has only a face, a flat face. In some books, they say that a flat surface or a curved surface, that's it. Okay. Hmm. Can you touch an edge? Yes. Can you touch a face? Yes. 3D shapes can have flat faces or curved surfaces. Yes. So in this book, they have introduced the word surface for curved. It has a curved surface and when it is a flat, it is flat. So it is face. A cylinder has two flat faces on one on the top and one on the bottom and one curved surface. Look at the pictures of 3D shapes. Join the shapes that are same. Oh, it is very easy. It will go with this. It will go with this. And it will go with this. Draw a ring around cubes. Color the cylinders yellow. And color the spheres blue. Yeah, it is easy to do. Draw a ring around cubes. So ring around cubes and all the cylinders you have to make yellow and all the spheres you will make blue. When is this chapter going to end? Okay. So half of the chapter is done in my today's video. I'm going to start my next video right from this page. Mm, from which page we, I have ended here on page 39. I'm going to start things uh, uh, this page, page number 40 uh, in my next video. Okay, thanks for watching. Allah Hafiz.